Yes, yes, boys, Kizan's back with another Darken Battle video, and on this video today, my guys, we're going to be looking at the Rainbow Star Easy Aid Up Super Saint 3 Gotenks. Now, as you can see, he's got Rainbow Star, he's SA-15, and uh, he's going to be pretty, pretty good. Now, I cannot make him have full additionals because I literally just rain, uh, ECA'd him, and I'm not spending, like, 30 Dragon Stones fixing that, so it is what it is. But before I get straight into this, let me show you the team build, and let me explain it how it goes down. So, we have him linked up with this Int Gotenks, which, or Int Goten, sorry, and this gives him nearly every attack link but he gets zero key links the reason why we are giving him zero key links is to see if we can get that 11 key more frequently so it's a little bit of a risk we're taking and of course if you do like this video don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more content and without further ado let's quickly get into the event and we are in the event my guys now, rotation's not looking the best off the bat. You know how it goes sometimes, so we're going to have to fix this up. How are we going to fix it? Uh, would be best, honestly, if we just do something like this, float one off, try to float him back. Honestly, that's probably just going to be easier for us. And uh, unfortunately, we do not get access to no eight, uh, tw 11 key. Sorry. Now, the reason why you want 11 key and not 12 or 10 is because when you hit that 11 key, you are super effective against all types, and that's kind of why people ask you to go additionals on him. But that's of course if you can get the 11 key, like, consistently, which is just not something you can do. Like, it's so much easier to get a 12 key than an 11 key, you guys must know this. And, uh, yeah, it causes so much problems, I'm not gonna lie, but... We're going to try our best. So the first super attack, of course, no support, no good linking partner. 3.5 million. Now, remember, he is stronger for the first seven turns than he is for, like, uh, you know, the usual after. But of course, we're going to still try and get him fixed up. Trying to get the Goten with him as soon as possible. But even that, like... Uh, that's definitely stronger than how he used to be before. I think I just did a showcase of him and with linking partner, 11 key and having a 50% uh, support, I think he just hit 3.5 then. So this just goes to show you already in a really bad situation, he's still providing some good numbers. Okay, and uh, what we're going to pop off here now. And we actually get the 11 key now. Uh, I'll keep it like this, why not, just throw support with him, let's see what he's hitting here, and by the way, defense check, we're on 153k, if you cannot see that, 153k, so, he can slap me, and let's see what we're hitting, 4.35, still no linking partner, still no linking partner, 4.35, look at that damage, man, look at that damage, okay, now that we have this rotation built up, it's going to be so much easier, just to do the event in general. Okay, I'm actually hitting that. I know he won't super attack this physical kid boo, but it's given me two physical orbs on the left. So, just like how we had to do for El Arbeerus on his uh, video, we have to prepare orbs for the next rotation. Well, that's if we don't kill, actually. Okay, oh, we don't actually kill here. Oh... God, we're going to take a bit of damage. It's... Oh, only Kid Boo's passive actually cares about being high HP, so... Oh, I'm sorry, Kid Boo. Okay, so with this being said, we kind of want to hit four or no, three orbs, but... That has been locked off to us, so we're going to have the 12 key, unfortunately. Okay, so three orbs is what we want if we have a support. If we didn't have a support, that would have been fine. Five million, okay. Not messing about here. We're not messing about. But honestly, that whole trying to get 11 key thing still annoys me though. I just don't think a unit should have that built in. I just I just think it's a bit of a waste. It's a really big waste. Okay, hitting same type orbs going to heal me up a bit. Just so uh, 
we'll have Kid Boost passive active for when we do see him and hopefully we can get that 11 key because uh, his passive only lasts 7 turns and I think it's going to run out or next turn is the last turn we do have it. So, I mean if it is, you know, just goes to show you sometimes, it, you know, sometimes it's difficult my dude, sometimes it can be difficult. Uh, okay, I know what I'm going to do here. Drop the purples. Okay, yeah, so we had to sacrifice a super attack to get this. But as I can show you now, look at this. So he has an additional boost for 7 turns. So, if he still got it here, this will be the highest he can hit. This will be his highest that I can get him to hit. So, you know, did take 5 minutes to get into the video, but let's see what my boy's hitting. Oh, no. Oh yes, okay, let's go. 5.48. Okay, 5.48. This is super effective. We hit the 11 key. Into a 5 mil additional. This is over 10 mil worth of damage. And he literally just one shot this Asia Vegeta. Okay, that is the power of this uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. Now, disclaimer though, he is not better than Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Super Saiyan 4, Goku, and uh, Physical Cooler are still the kings of uh, Easy A's. T for the TUR, sorry. So, but that doesn't change the fact he's still broken as hell. Like, he's amazing. Just can't give him... I can't give him a number one or number two slot. Maybe not even number three, but he's definitely up there. Trust me, he's up there. But now his attack will have lowered. Now, we have passed the seven turns. And with that 7 turns being passed, we lose some defense, we lose some offense. I don't even know why they build units like this anymore. Like, what's the point of making units only short term? Okay, now we have absolutely zero support here. So we're actually going to get hit with the needing 6 key. So we're just going to be ending up getting a 10 key there. Nothing much. Only 123k defense also. We're missing a lot of super attacks. Again, I bought this guy or the Int Goten to get the most out of the attack links. But I got zero key links activated and it's like, that's good for Gotenks because you want to get 11 key. So you don't want to have key. But then it kind of shafts the linking partner because then they will not get a super. And it, you can never win both ways unless both of the linking partners don't want a 12 key. It just doesn't make sense, really. Okay, Eve, we did some okay damage there, honestly. 3 mil, no support. 3 mil, no support against, uh, you know, getting a 10 key as well. Even after the passive has worn off, that's still some good damage. And of course, Super Saiyan, or not even Super Saiyan, just Goku and Vegeta strength does... Piling the damage on. We like that. We like that. Bloody hell, man. They do not want to stop. Which is just the one with the linking partner, man. Then this would have been over this fight. And, uh... We like that animation so much. Let's quickly see it again. Look at those int orbs. Oh my god. Why are the orbs looking so good? Now, we do have a support next turn. So, we want to get three orbs available. Can I even get three orbs ready? Like... I don't think I can. I really don't think I can. Is that going to drop some reds to make it three? It actually did drop the red orbs to be three red orbs. Why did I wait? Oh, okay. I was going to say, why did I waste so much time if I'm killing this rotation? No, that was my bad. But with that dodge, I don't think we kill anymore. I do not think we kill. Unless this guy's hitting like a big crit or... Uh, 4.7 mil attack stack. I think I think he is going to hit a big, big crit, isn't it? Don't do it. Okay. Oh, oh man. Because I knew physical kid boo wouldn't have even killed there. But the additional slap from them definitely will. Definitely will. Okay, hold up. Let's, let's work this out. Let's work this out. Hit a bit of that first. And then we get three orbs there. It worked out perfectly. We are sitting on 138k defense. Even though we have passed the seven turns. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice. 
we're going to take some damage from this stuff. He does not have the damage reduction active. Yep, we don't have him with the trunks. But let's see what the go tanks is hitting now. Okay, come on. This is going to be the highest. No, not the highest he can do. But this is going to be a general roundabout of his 11 key power after nerf. And 4.4 mil. So he did lose a little bit of attack power. But that's not enough to stop him from not doing good damage. And that was super effective. Gotta love the super effectiveness. When you can land the 11 key, yes, you do have to like think a bit more. Like you need to be planning out orbs. But, you know, when you get it, it's uh, some nice, nice damage. Uh, I'll hit that. Does it put three together? No, it does not. But I've got two physicals there. So I guess we're going to be able to get a 12 key, I guess. <laughs> next turn, next turn. So much of thought has to go into this damn rotation. I don't know how I feel about it. Okay, which is this going to do? Not much. But uh, yeah, obviously this is probably not the best team you'd want to take him in because, let's be honest, there are better options on the Majin Buu Saga team. But I mean, if you're going for like a youth category team or something like that, definitely a good idea. Just checking every single one and uh, we cannot get, we're going to go for 12k this time, see what we can get off 12k. Even that guy can't super because of the key problems. And neither can he, god. No one is supering here because of the key problems. Except, you know, the actual Super Saiyan 3 go tanks. With a 4 million though, that's some good damage. I mean, we don't really need to be super effective when we're against an int unit, right? So that would have just wasted a bit of time. Uh, you know what, if we're going to do this, we might as well end it in style, right? You know, I love seeing the Vegito. Quick Patara up. Okay, now let's begin. Oh, that could have been three orbs if those blues did not drop. It could have been three orbs. Yeah, no. Oh, I think we still do have access to three orbs, actually, for the final rotation. Yeah, I think we do. I think I saw three orbs for the blues. Okay, okay. We, we have a chance next turn again. Five point three million. Yeah, okay, this is going to do some damage though. This boy does not take damage quite easy. 129k, yeah. Okay, so next rotation should be the... Uh, oh no, free ops does not matter because we don't have a, a support on the next rotation, do we? No, we do not, so... Uh, we're going to need to hit up 5 orbs, which we have access to, okay. That makes a lot of help. I'm not going to transform now. Might as well keep some damage reduction. Okay, so no support, 11 key. No support, 3.7 mil. No support at all, 3.7 mil, that's good. That, you know. If you told me he would be doing that with no support, I would be like, yeah, okay. After the amount of turns that has passed... And we're going to finish this up. Of course, this guy will be better, better with a better linking part. Now, of course, you could link him up with Intergo tanks that I do not have. So that's why you have to see the team like this. But we're going to finish it up there. Okay, so. Hmm, let me know what your thoughts are of this guy. I think he's a, he's a very nice addition. Very, very nice addition. Although, I just don't think he's a special as the other EZAs that have come after or before him, sorry. 
I don't know what it is about him. He's just really nice. He does some good damage. I just I would like a better linking partner. That's probably my fault though, because I cannot pull Int Gotex. But for you guys that have got Int Gotex, you may have a better chance. These were the link levels, not the craziest about in the mid level, except Fierce Battle got up to seven, Budding Warrior eight. But yeah, link level's not the highest. Let me know what you think of him, and uh, hopefully you did enjoy this little showcase video of him on the Majin Buu Saga. And if you did enjoy, you know what I'm going to say. you got to hit your boy with that like and subscribe button. But I will catch you on the next video. This is Kizan Bouncing Out. Check the channel out for more Dark and content or maybe some Legend stuff. And I'll see you then. This is me going in a bizzle.